Hello guys, I'm back. Yay! So um, today I'm going to be talking some, talking about something that's uh. Sorry, I, I, sorry, I can't want to do that. But yeah, this was actually about a week ago. Um, this, uh, it's sort of a new rule or change in the NFL. It's for the special teams. If you guys don't know by now, I'm talking about the uh, PATs. We moved back to the 15-yard line. And you're thinking, what, really? Move back? Psh, they don't need that. Well, apparently the owners, the NFL owners and the, and Roger Goodell, I guess, wanted to excite football, I guess you want to say. It's exciting either way, but apparently they want to excite it, so they're moving the PATs back to the 15-yard line. And yes, it's going to happen for this season. You're thinking, no, it won't happen until next season. No. This season is going to happen, so you guys better come watch the NFL this year because it's going to be exciting. Sorry, I don't know why I did that. Um, oh yeah, there's uh, um, it's 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 going to be very very interesting because all the kickers are talking about it. All the NFL kickers are talking about it. Some like it, some don't. I know. Son, um, I know Son, Sean Sweezum for Pittsburgh Steelers talked to, talk about if you liked it or not. Uh, Pat McPhee and Matt Vinterian, I know, talk, talked about it. And a bunch of other kickers talked about it. Some liked it, some don't. And, you know, it really depends on how they like it. I guess, I guess you want to say or how, how you want to say. It's very... I want to say mind blowing because they were talking about this for months and years actually, so I'm not really surprised that they were that they want to change things up. So, so yeah, um, yeah, the, um, they uh, from the 15 yard line, I guess you want to say if it was a field goal instead of PAT, that that's a that's a 33 yard field goal. Anything? Wait, how'd you get third? Wait, how'd you get 33 out of 15? Well, I'll tell you, it's actually some math, if you, if you guys know. Um, if you guys didn't know, the one-yard line is actually 18, is an 18-yard field goal, which rarely, rarely, rarely happens in the NFL, mostly because people are going to go for it on one yard away to the touchdown, just saying. So basically, if you add 18 plus 15, that will give you 33, if you guys know your math. So yeah, a little math there. Um, and um, from... From 2014, or I guess you want to say, two years ago, or last year, whatever you want to say, um, in that 30, in that 30 to 39 range, it's been pretty good at honestly. It's actually, it's actually a good range, because it's about 87 percent, which is actually really good. If it was lower, they would have thought about it, but since it's about 87 percent, exactly, you're thinking, well. 15 yards, that's honestly not that far. And you're thinking, that's, that's not that far. But you but you guys have to think about, there's going to be weather they have to deal with. There's going to be, uh, they're going to put more power into the leg, you know. Or, you know, a whole bunch of things are going to change. In Chicago, it's, be more, it's going to be more difficult because, hello, the windy, hello, the windy city, baby. What, what? All right, Chicago fans, what up? Um, and, uh, well, obviously it's not going to really affect people indoors like Minnesota, Detroit, Indiana, not Indiana, um, Colts, thank you guys. Um, it's not going to affect those teams because they're indoors. What's going to affect them? The air conditioning? Seriously? So, so all the teams that are outdoors or deal with Windy City or Rain City in, in uh, Seattle, so... So it depends on the weather and how how it's going to fit. To me, I don't really think that um, it's the uh, 15 yard. It's not really going to affect anything besides the weather wise. Other than what's what's going to change? It's still going to be they kick the ball from 15 yards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not going to be moved left or right. It's going to be straight on in the middle. So it'll be like, what exactly is is the problem? If you if you guys know what the problem is. Comment down below, and I'll tell you right now, that's going to be a very interesting comment down below. Um, when when the owners were talking about it, there so like like I said, there were some owners, but the eight owners that weren't exactly happy about it. 
I don't want to say I know what they're saying, but it's just like I don't know exactly how to be an owner, so I so I so I can't really have an opinion by. Well, my only opinion is like there's not going to be like I said, nothing's going to be really changed except it's going to be moved back, but still in the middle. The only thing they got to deal with is weather-wise. I mean, field-wise, it should be the same because all they move is just moved back. It's it's like like I said, it's it's like making a 33-yard field goal with or without wind, or with the with or without weather doesn't matter. So, so um, it's just like it just depends on how you guys look at it. Like you could look at it like, oh, this you know can, this can hurt the teams by yada yada yada, or you can look at it like, um, or some people are or some people are talking about, it can get people more. It can get teams more um, opinion, uh, more chance, I guess you want to say, by uh, by having more room and go by go for two, and by that's basically why they're also going. Uh, also, why they moved back, because two yards and about what five yards for the end zone, that's that's like or about five. That, that's not much room for you know if you're going for two plus you got so much room for you know for the end zone. It's like. So I so they, if they move back, if they, if they got more of a chance, they got eight more yards. I guess you want to say eight, nine, however big the end zone is, plus the two yards and plus whatever fifteen is. So basically, it's from fifteen to back in the end zone, whatever. So yeah, you know. So it's just so it just depends on how you, how you guys look at it. Yada yada yada. That's basically that's basically what I'm talking about. Is the new rule for PAT. If you and uh, some. Some kickers. I'll, well, Jay Freely. Sorry, I say the name wrong. Jay. He had, he had some opinion about it, and I, I I agree with him because it's like he said, uh, "Well, what happens if well well you have to think about off the defense you know line because they're going to be pounding each other every single time, and if they go for two, I can, I can see that, but I'm also thinking, well, well, I'm trying to think of the kicker side and stay on their side, but. I don't know. It's, it's it's hard to decide. If you guys if you guys choose between you know, you know, the kicker side or the other side, I guess you want to say whatever you want to call. It. But yeah, Jay had had a good point like about saying um how if if the teams went for two a lot more instead of go for the extra point, I guess you want to say players have more chance of getting hurt and you know, whole bunch of other stuff and other things. I can see why, because you know, they have a certain amount of players they can use before people get hurt, and then they have to make them resign, and add sign, sign, and pick. It's a whole big fiasco. If you guys, if you guys want to comment down below if it's a great idea or a bad idea, just comment down below. I trust me, I believe in you guys. But yeah, it's a whole big thing. If you got an opinion about it, obviously description comment down below. I I actually would like to hear some of the opinions because who do I hear from? No one exactly. So yeah. And um uh if you guys want to see the 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 article that I'm talking about, I'll, I'll put it in the description below. They have other articles about kickers saying stuff about this and all bunch of other ones. There's also a one about uh, uh safeties and. But I'm not gonna get into that because if it's special teams, psh, who's gonna talk about it? If it's not, then I'll, I'll, let, I'll let all the other people talk about that. But I'm, special teams, right here, baby. But yeah, uh, thank you for watching. Yeah, so uh, if you guys got an opinion about this new rule or whatever you want to say, please comment down below. I would actually like to hear some opinions because, like I said, I'm I'm think I'm sort of thinking both sides, but mostly the one way because hey. Would you want more? You want more injured players or not? So I'm so excited. I'm sort of agreeing with Jay, but what he said about the new, uh, uh, new, the, the new rule, and like I said, it, it's it's really it's really opinion and about some that's not not, not going to change because, well, you can just think the new what you think what well, not not really think, but you can. Say the, the owners and you know NFL committee about what they had to say. So yeah, I guess you want, I guess you want to say that. But yeah, uh, so again, thank you for watching. Uh, comment down below about your opinion about this. Also comment about.
comment about the uh, safety. If you guys know about that, if you guys know, well, catch up on football. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah. Thank you for at least, you know, watching this video. Uh, follow me at Twitter, FTBL Jake12. I'll, I'll put that in the description below. I don't know, I forgot it's my own Twitter. And um, I guess I'll see you guys later for some new, for some other information. See you guys. Bye.